Good evening, an undocumented immigrant who was shot this morning by an ICE officer has surrendered to the FBI. Federal agents say they were trying to take him into custody for being in the country illegally. The situation has sparked fear and a quickly arranged meeting for those in the area. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs was at that meeting tonight where community organizers say this could have been worse. Right now, our community is living in fear. America Leon is talking about an incident early Thursday morning involving a federal immigration officer firing shots while trying to take someone into custody. The incident this morning just brings awareness of why our community should be more together than ever before. The call came in around 7 a.m. of a shooting at the parking lot near Food Lion on Richards Road. Surveillance video shows an unmarked law enforcement car parked in front of a white box truck. FBI officials say DHS officers were trying to stop a man from Mexico in the country illegally, who allegedly had been deported from the U.S. multiple times. Agents say the suspect tried to flee in the truck and drove towards the agent when the agent fired two rounds. The man was hurt, but his injuries as of right now are unknown. And this is where we prepare our community to have an emergency plan. Now Leon and other community organizers are coming together in the same parking lot to remind immigrants of all nationalities of their rights. If we educate our community and we educate the agents on how to approach these situations, incidents like today will not be happening. Leon says the situation could have gone from bad to worse. Tennessee is a state that welcomes their neighbor. And I believe that this is where we come in as a community and we try to educate our community on their rights. We try to educate them on what's fair. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.